The skincare website makes $200 million every year. And if you really want to build a premium brand like The Ordinary, then you need WordPress in your life. So in this video, I'll show you exactly how to build a complete skincare e-commerce store like The Ordinary using WordPress and Elementor Pro step by step, start to finish. Let's go. We'll begin by setting up our website from scratch, starting with hosting and WordPress installation. For this, I'm using Bluehost. It's beginner friendly, comes with a free domain and lets you install WordPress in one click. Once you've signed up for their basic shared hosting plan, just pick a domain name that fits your brand, something like glowleafbeauty.com. After completing the sign up and payment, Bluehost automatically installs WordPress for you. And within a couple of minutes, you will be inside your WordPress dashboard at yourdomain.com or WP Admin. Now that WordPress is ready, the first thing we'll do is install a clean, lightweight theme. I'm going with Astra because it's fast and pairs really well with Elementor, which we'll use to design the different pages for our site. Next, we'll add Elementor. Go to Plugins, click on Add New, search Elementor and install it. If you also have Elementor Pro uploaded from .zip file, install it and activate both. To turn this into an e-commerce store, you need to install WooCommerce. Again, from the Plugins menu, search for WooCommerce, install and activate it, WooCommerce will launch a setup wizard, so please don't skip this. Just fill in your business details, select the currency, now enable payments like PayPal or Stripe, depending on what you plan to use. Once you complete the setup wizard, WooCommerce will automatically generate essential pages like Shop, Cart, Checkout and My Account. These are the core pages that make your store functional right out of the box. But before we move forward with adding products and designing the homepage, there's one quick thing you should do and it's important. Head to the description below and click the link to Airlift. Add your store's URL and within seconds, Airlift will give you a free performance score of your website. It also checks for things like unoptimized images, unused code and basically all the little things that slow down your site. If your store's already loading slow, this will catch it. And if everything is good, you'll still get suggestions to make it faster. The best part, you don't need to be technical. It optimizes everything for you with one click. Now let's go back. And before we jump into adding products, let's make two important changes. First, go to Pages. Click on Add New. Create a page called Home and publish it. Then head to Settings. Click on Reading and set this new page as your home page. Next, go to the settings, check the permalinks and switch to post name. This gives you clean SEO friendly URLs that are easy to read and share. Now let's start adding products. Head over to products, click on add new and create your first product. For example, vitamin C glow serum, add a product image. Write a compelling description explaining the ingredients and benefits. Then add a short summary under product short description. Now let's set the price, say $35 and assign it to a category like serums. If you want to manage stock, you can enable inventory tracking here as well. Next, let's add a variable product like a lip balm that comes in multiple flavors. Set the product type to variable product. Then under attributes, create a new attribute called flavor and add the options separated by pipe, mint, rose, vanilla. Check use for variations and move to the variations tab. Generate all variations, then assign individual prices and images. To make the flavor selector look nice, install a plugin like variation swatches for WooCommerce, which turns drop down into clickable buttons. Once your products are ready, it's time to set up shipping. Go to WooCommerce, click on Settings, and set up shipping and create two zones. One for the US with a flat rate of $5 and free shipping over $50. You can customize these later depending on where your customers are located. Now look for payments and activate the gateways you want. For this store, I'm enabling PayPal and also keeping cash on delivery for local customers who prefer offline payments. Stripe is another great option if you want to accept credit cards directly. At this point, your store is technically functional. 
but to turn it into a polished brand experience, we'll build the home page using Elementor. Go to Pages, look for All Pages, click on Home, then click Edit with Elementor. Start with a full width section of your hero banner. Add a background image that fits your brand. Maybe a model with glowing skin or a flat lay of your products. Then drop in a heading like glow naturally. A subheading like pure plant powered skincare. And a shop now button that links to your shop page. Below that, add an about us section with two columns, text on the left and an image on the right. Use the space to briefly tell your brand story or mission. After that, create a three column section for your featured categories. Serums, cleansers, masks. Use image boxes to show category photos and link each of its respective archive pages. Now let's highlight your best selling products. Elementor Pro includes a WooCommerce products widget. So just drag it, set the query to pull products tagged with best seller and style it to match your theme. Now add a testimonial section with two to three customer reviews, profile images, and quotes from your actual customers. Trust is everything in skincare and you need to add it as soon as you can. Finally, embed a newsletter sign up from using WP Forms. Now that the home page is done, let's focus on improving the product experience because in skincare, how your product images feel matter as much as how they look. We'll start by designing a custom single product layout using Elementor Pro's Theme Builder. Go to Templates, look for Theme Builder, click on Single Product, then Add New. Give it a name like Skincare Product Layout. Start with a two-column layout. On the left side, drag the Product Images widget. Set the style to clean, maybe hide the borders for a softer look. On the right, drop in the product title followed by the product price and then Product Rating widget. Below that, add the short description, then the Add to Cart button. Make this full width with soft corners and pastel tones to match a luxury aesthetic. Finish with product meta for category and tags in smaller italicized text. Next, let's handle the product tabs. We'll use Elementor's toggle widget to create a clean accordion style layout. Add a new section, drag in two toggles, and the second shows customer reviews. This gives the page a clean, modern FAQ feel that's easier to navigate, especially on mobile. Optionally, you can add a final section for related products using the related products widget. Set it to show three columns so users can browse similar items, increasing the chance of add-on purchases. Click Publish and under Display Conditions, set it to apply to all products. From now on, every product page on your site will use this beautiful brand aligned layout. Now let's do the same for your shop page. Head back into Templates, click on Theme Builder and click Archive Product. Call it Custom Shop Page and create a new layout. Begin with the full width hero section. Drop in a background image with a bold heading like skincare that loves you back and a subheading like explore your curated range of clean beauty essentials. Under that, build a horizontal filter bar. You can add category filter buttons using the product category widgets and optionally include a sort drop down and search bar. This makes it easier for users to explore your catalog without getting lost. Now drag in the products widget and configure it to show your WooCommerce products in a three or four column grid. Set pagination style to load more or use numbered pages. Customize the product cards, add a zoom in effect on hover, soften the box shadow and use elegant fonts like Playfair display to match the luxury skincare vibe. For the style of the price, anything that catches your eye like a soft rose or dusty pink works beautifully. Once done, hit publish and assign this layout to product archives and shop page under display conditions. Now all your category, tag, shop pages will follow this consistent polished design. Before we wrap, we need to create a few essential static pages. Go to pages, click on add new and create about us, contact us, FAQ. You can come back later to style these using Elementor. Last step, let's polish the global elements. Use Elementor's theme builder to create a header and footer. For the header, add your logo on the left. 
navigation menu in the center and a cart icon on the right. In the footer, use a three column layout, the first column for a short about section, second for quick links and the third for another newsletter sign up form. Before launching, make sure to test everything, add a product to the cart, go to the checkout, try different payment methods and check your email for the confirmation message. It's always better to catch errors now than after the launch. And that's it. Your skincare e-commerce store is ready to go live. Now, if you want your products to show up on Google search results, you will need to connect your store to a Google Merchant Center account. That's what tells Google exactly what you're selling and keep your product data in sync. So if you want to set that up next, just check this video and I'll show you exactly how to connect Google Merchant Center to your WordPress site step by step. Click here if you want to 3x your site speed in just one minute. Trust me, you're going to love it. Click here and I'll see you there.